we're in Changi Airport and today we're flying to Saigon or Ho Chi Minh City, Vietnam in economy class with Singapore Airlines. Let's go! Today we're flying with Singapore Airlines to Saigon in economy class. We checked in at Terminal 2 and there was a lot of automated check-in kiosk, so there was no reason to use in check-in counters. They also had an automated backdrop machine, and you have to scan a boarding pass and passport for each luggage. So we could calculate the total weight, and we could carry 60 kilo luggage for all three of us on this trip. There's a reason that Changi Airport had won Skytrax award 12 times. Cause this airport is truly amazing. It is a destination in itself and you should set enough time to explore this airport. Since I have a Star Alliance Gold, we had access to the Chris Flyer Gold Lounge. To get access to the Silver Chris Lounge, you need to travel in Business Class or have a Status Solitaire PPS or PPS Club member. We went for the Chris Flyer Gold Lounge in Terminal 2, since it was the closest to our gate. The lounge has capacity for 160 persons, and the seats are not so private. The lounge has a self-serve buffet selection. This features both hot and cold options. The menu wasn't the most exciting that day. To be honest, this lounge was very disappointing. The lack of facilities, daylight, and dining table made it awkward to sit and eat. If you need to use the bathroom, you have to go outside and use the public facilities in the terminal. Time to head to our gate, F56. But before we could go to our gate, we had to go through the security screening, which is at the boarding gate. On the Boeing 787-10, there are 36 business class seats. These seats are configured in a one-to-one -one layout. There is a total of 301 economy class seats, split into 150 in the forward section and 151 in the rear. These seats are configured in a 3-3-3 layout. Extra legroom seats are in row 58 and cost extra to reserve, while the forward zone also costs extra to reserve. It is defined as row 41 to 47. Note that row 57 and 69 is missing a window, while two sets of couple seats are available in row 74 and 75. It's mandatory with mask on this flight. Our seat for this flight was 41 Juliet and Kilo. Singapore Airlines used the Recaro CL3710 seats for economy class on its Boeing 787-10. It has a slim light design, which makes it more suitable for regional routes than long-haul flying. The universal outlet are located beneath the seats. This only applies for bulkhead seats. For the other seats, they are beneath the armrest divider 
and the three passengers have to share two outlets. We find a tray table at the armrest and it looks like the crew haven't been cleaning my table. The headrest can fold so you can get a good neck support. Both get seats have very good leg space and that is a lifesaver when traveling with a baby. It was worth the extra cost. There are no individual air nozzle on this airplane. Bulkhead seats are the only seat with the IFE remote, since the screen are too far in the front to be navigated via touch. Economy class passenger have a personal 11.6 inch high definition touchscreen. The headphones, as expected, are not the best quality. You can keep this after a flight, but really, they're flimsy and cheap, and there's no reason why you want to. The jack accepts any standard 3.5mm cables, so you might even want to bring your own set for better audio quality and comfort. The coolest feature on the 787 are the dimmable windows. There's a gel between the glass which responds to electric current. When the passenger presses the dim button, the current increases and the gel becomes darker. And opposite, when the passenger presses the light button, the current decreases and more lights come in. The cabin crew have a master control switch which allows them to change the color of a single window, a section or the entire aircraft. As soon as we reach cruising altitude, the windows were dimmed. For lunch, we got served sort of braised beef and mushroom ragu with mashed potato as a western option. For eastern option, we got salted fish fried rice with chicken. My wife liked the braised beef, but the fried rice was a bit too dry for my taste. The meals are served in a lightweight brown paper boxes with bamboo cutlery. I'm even impressed that they are even serving food on a such short flight. In my defense, we are used to fly with Scandinavian Airlines on a short haul flight. You either get coffee or tea on a plane, or you can buy some snacks. Singapore Airlines offer a solid economy class product on its regional flights. We are not used to this kind of service on a short haul flight. So we had a great experience with Singapore Airlines in economy class. I'm not gonna lie, but the extra leg room made the whole trip so much better. We recommend to choose the bulkhead seat if you can. We hope you enjoyed watching our video and sharing in our incredible flight to Saigon. Thank you for your continued support and we're looking forward to bringing more amazing content in the future. Until then, take care and see you next time.